I'm Vanessa Kennedy's Courtney Langevin, and I'm outside KSC, taking you inside KSC. NASA and SpaceX announced that they are targeting no earlier than October 23, 2020 for their first operational flight with crew to the International Space Station. Part of the agency's commercial crew program, Crew-1, will be the first of regular rotational missions to the orbiting laboratory. The SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket, topped with the company's Crew Dragon spacecraft, is scheduled to lift off from Kennedy Space Center's historic launch complex 39A in Florida. Crew Dragon will carry spacecraft commander Michael Hopkins, pilot Victor Glover, mission specialist Shannon Walker, and mission specialist Soichi Noguchi to the space station for a six-month science mission. Hopkins, Glover, and Walker are all NASA astronauts, and Noguchi is a Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency astronaut. In preparation for the launch, the crew of four recently completed emergency egress training in Florida. The two training scenarios involve simulating emergency situations following splashdown of the spacecraft, as well as just before liftoff at the launch pad. Senior leaders at Kennedy held a virtual town hall meeting on August 20th, where questions submitted by the workforce were answered. Participating in the town hall were Center Director Bob Cabana, Deputy Director Janet Petra, and Associate Directors Kelvin Manning and Bert Summerfield. During the live broadcast, Kennedy employees were encouraged to email in any questions they had for upper management. The town hall touched on a variety of topics, from looking back at the success of recent launches, to what lies ahead, to updates on the criteria for returning to on-site work. For more Inside KSC, check us out on social media and at nasa.gov slash Kennedy.